Hi, welcome to Excel Rush. Today we are going to learn how to transpose multiple rows and columns together in one shot. So instead of transposing single row or single column, we'll do it multiple. Before I go ahead, kindly consider to subscribe to the channel. And if you like what you learn, do hit like. So this is the sample data that we're going to use to understand how to transpose multiple rows and columns together. In a single transpose, what I would do is, let's say I want the name column, I would select that, hit copy, control C, go wherever I need to to transpose it, right click and say, pay special transpose. That's what I would do, simply for one single column. I'm going to undo this. Same for one single row. I would select this and copy and paste it with transpose. But if I want to do multiple, all I have to do is select everything together, copy, go wherever I need to, right click, pay special and transpose. As simple as that. So many of you might have been using the function equal to transpose for it, but you don't really need to use that unless you want something to be dynamic. If you just want to transpose, this is how you can do it very, very easily, just by selecting multiple rows and columns together. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video as well.